Welcome to this safe haven where opportunity lives to seek a receiver. Whether or not you're eligible for courses, where burning potential meets accessible resources, it turns locals into tourists, trying to decipher what the impeccable allure is. The glass doors are open arms for those with an allergic reaction to a career full of rules. Welcoming creatives into this spaceship, transporting extraterrestrials inside the vast artistic universe where shining stars align the red interior walls. A reminder to the stars in the making when creating. Give a little extra to rest real talent on the hard concrete work. These hard concrete walls have ears, consuming stories, imagery. The cracks in the bricks act as the mouthpiece to the past, regurgitating history. From 1846, humble beginnings, the home of engine maintenance to 1864, a house that manufactured whiskey, brandy and gin. From then till now, not much has changed except simply the family within. Now, it helps to maintain and manufacture futures. They swapped engines for creative drive, the gin for free spirits in control of shaping a life one desires with a helping hand and a plan to begin. The history echoes throughout the eerie archway corridors in eternal competition with the ghost of progress, possessing the artists set on making magic in the Dorfman hub, a spitting image of Stonehenge, a few feet beneath the main stage. It's clear good art isn't site specific, doesn't need any type of gimmicks, the sky's the limit to our comfort zones, where imagination meets curiosity, breaking through, revealing one man's ceiling is another man's floor. From rehearsing in the claw, wishing to reach the transition where a ground level emerging artist crosses over to the main attraction. The only difference is a few thousand supporters and three flights of stairs reminding me I'll get there one step at a time. <laughs> the irony. Stevenson, Robert Dockery, two men I would like to honour. They left a legacy for parallel worlds to intertwine, configure minds in a girdle, conversations over wine or fosters about grime and opera, no matter the type of colour industry challenges, how race can delay one's time to prosper, all find sanctuary in this circle, plucked from the seed of life, transformed into a safe haven that has never felt more like home, even in times during 2011. We felt the wrath of young London in uproar, some saw local family businesses in Chalk Farm burning alive on their front door. The directors lost their appetite over dinner, Unsure if this community hub would be cremated next. Blind to the fact a unanimous decision to spare the roundhouse was being sent in messages on WhatsApp and relayed in text. This is a safe haven where opportunity lives to seek a receiver. Whether or not you're eligible for courses. Where burning potential meets accessible resources. It turns locals into tourists trying to decipher what the impeccable allure is. The roundhouse is a second home to many, whether experienced in your craft or only at the start. Every successful project is a thank you to the visionaries who keep this building open for the arts.